been crying out for revival in our city. We've been learning about revival, but I've never seen it. I didn't even know it was real. I'm like, they're, I'm just sitting in class and they're telling us all these stories on college campuses and then going across the nation. And we're like, where, when is this going to happen? And then they lock you in a prayer room and you're just like, hey, you got to ask for it. And we're just sitting there like, God, I'm asking. What, what does it look like? And then all of a sudden, my friend Jaden says, dude, if Jesus just localized himself and just sat his throne in a room, how could we not drive six and a half hours to go see yeah. And we get here. And we get here. And it was like complete. We get here at like 6 a.m. And it's completely silent. And I'm like, well, um, is this revival, God? And uh, we walk upstairs because we're kind of nervous. We're like kind of shaking already. We didn't get any sleep. Just they're terrible road trip partners. They both fell asleep. I drove most of the way. But besides that, we go upstairs and there's people like sleeping. And we're like, so this is revival, God? No. Cool. This, this is awesome. And then chapel starts. And immediately we just see people flooding in. And God said, revival isn't hype. It's ordinary people who are hungry. It's ordinary people who are hungry. And he said, Gage, I'm going to need you to go to the altar. And I'm like, I don't want to go to the altar. <laughs> and he's like, go to the altar. And I go to the altar and worship starts. And he's like, this is revival. Look left. And I look left. And there's this young college woman getting prayed over by an older woman. And he says, look right. And then there's this young guy praying over an older guy. And he says, look behind you. And everyone's just raising their hands. And he said, Gage, this is revival. It isn't hype. It's ordinary people crying out for a move of God in our generation. And I'm here to talk to everybody in this room who is hungry. What an honor. What an honor it is to be here. Revival's real. It isn't just a story we've heard about. It's come. And it's not just come here today, but it's about to spread out to the nation. It's about to spread out to the United States. And I'm here to talk to every young person in this room. I just gave my life a year and a half ago to Christ, and it has been the greatest thing I have ever done. I left everything, and I'm here to talk to every young person in this room. Forget the job, forget the girl, forget the guy, forget everything. He's worthy, he's worthy, and I'm here. And I'm just saying, oh, it's such an honor. If you don't feel that joy inside of you, I don't know what's going on. It's real. Amen. I love you guys. <laughs>